Better bring up the first baseman, Wally Joyner. I'll never take it for granted, the privilege of playing the game and putting on the uniform. You can hear the announcement in the background as Joyner comes to the plate. I enjoy the lights and the fans, the excitement. Joyner stepping in, busted to the delight of the crowd. That's what's fun. Those are the reasons why we come and play. Third ball hit hard to right. It's going to be a base hit. It's a base hit and RBI for Wally Joyner. The Angels lead 5-2. to two. Drive to deep right field and gone. Joyner has hit a home run to tie the game. You know, there were a lot of fond memories that I had of that season. Uh, I broke up a couple of no-hitters. Base hit. The no-hitter is gone, and it's a tie game. I got off to a fast start. The 23-year-old rookie led the majors with 13 homers and 35 RBI. Everything was going 100 miles an hour. The first rookie ever elected to the All-Star Game starting lineup. Number 21, Wally Joyner. I was a kid in the candy store, and to be announced as one of the starters, and just absolutely incredible. And to have that happen my first year, I'll never forget it. Wally World. The Wally World, of course. John Ball to the shortstop, Schofield. Who goes to McLemore? Who goes to Wally World? Wally World was a little catchy slogan that uh, was, was fitting for the first couple of years because a player by the name of Wally uh, was playing in Anaheim right down the street from Disneyland. My first two years were outstanding. It's at the straightaway center. Mosby's got to turn. Go back to the wall. He'll watch it. Go out of the park. A two-run homer for Wally Joyner. We won the pennant in 1986. Those so first two years are my favorite two years that I've ever had. I was a left-handed baseball player, so I watched a lot of left-handed players, Reggie Jackson, George Brett. One of the amazing and great things in my career was I was able to idolize those guys and then put on the uniform with them. But those are the greatest moments that I've had, was to hit in front of Reggie Jackson and hit behind George Brett. The reason why we play is because we enjoy the game. We also like to entertain the people who like to come out and watch the game being played the way it's supposed to be played. It's always been a, a joy for me and I, it's my life. <laughs>